Peace Volume 2 launch. This year, as editor, I have redesigned the launch compared to last year. Last year I did it publicly. Um, this year I've decided to not make it a public issue. This year I've decided to make it very private and only about 12 people were invited this year. Um, the reason for that is because a magazine launch is, is important, but a magazine launch party is not so important. And for the people who are closest to the magazine, this year I only wanted them involved. As promised, we were able to put one of his piece on the magazine cover. So not only that, you will see our piece volume two as an art piece recognition, but you will see our piece volume two and the work of Bobby Zen fronting it. And one of the things that I learned last year was um, to do the magazine a little different and to do the launch a little different. The thing that I learned last year was that doing the launch publicly, I have very little control over the launch and what went on. So this year, if I did it very small in my control, then it will pretty much go the way I want it to go. And the reason why we're here today is just to say, Bobby Zen, Ste uh, Stefan, Jay, Yvonne, Daggy, now Tina Sebas, the work that they did is being put in a magazine, so I'm the one that was responsible for choosing what went into the magazine. And uh, the whole purpose of today is only to acknowledge that the job is done, the magazine is made, it's now a published edition, Swiss edition, part two. And I would like to say thanks to Bobby Zen, thanks to Tina Sebas, thanks to Stefan for contributing his photographs, which I have always expressed my admiration of the pictures you've taken, because even though many people can have a camera and just click it away, not everybody has the eye that the person behind the camera has to capture. And for that reason, I says to Stefan, I believe your work is more than worthy to be in a magazine. To my son Jay, I've always been his mentor, his pusher, to say, do more, write more, draw more. And this year, in comparison to last year's work, I've seen that his work has advanced. Even though he's my son, I cut him no slacks. If his work is not up to scratch, it will not make the magazine. You know? The same goes for my wife, and unfortunately, I can't say the same goes for my reason, because I love his work. You know, when my reason finds faults with his work, I can't see the fault. You know, <laughs> I say it's perfect, and he goes, no, I'm not happy with this, or I'm not happy with that. So, once again, thank you guys for contributing to the magazine. Thank you guys for showing up and being here. And I hope you guys feel the atmosphere that I was trying to make you feel. And that atmosphere is the closeness of only the people that's involved in the magazine. It was not for the public this year. The magazine is for the public worldwide. But the birth of the magazine today was only for family and contributors. So, thanks again. Good afternoon to you all. And thank you for taking the time out to come to Art Peace Magazine Launch Part 2, Volume 2. All of you are aware of Volume 1, having attended the launch party last year in Bulak. Art is everything our eyes perceive as art. It could be a lonely man sitting with his dog on the street corner watching the world go by. Abstract art many people don't understand but it's left up to one's imagination. Photography as seen in this year's magazine by Stefan Cope, or The Art of Ice in the Cake like Yvonne Donald, also in the magazine. Art Piece intends to create more magazines and take art from all walks of life and imaginations. A big thank you goes out to Sebastian Books for publishing this year and last year's magazine. Ethan Sebastian, who has worked tirelessly to put this issue together. 
to the sponsors who contributed financially, and to the contributors of art, Babizan, Stefan, Jay, Dagi from Deutschland, and Yvonne from England. Food is available to eat and drink, as much as your stomach can handle. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, as most of you may know, I'm the artist professor for Polzingo. Last time, at the Art Piece One launch, I talked a little bit how I met Ethan and how I started to draw. Today, I want to talk a little bit more about the most challenging piece of art I've ever drawn up to date. I spent about 21 hours for this amazing piece. I was inspired by the female's beauty and the style of the picture. I'm talking about Adriano Limo. The image which I'm happy was chosen, was chosen to be the cover of the art piece volume 2. It is a sexy and stylish art of Adriano, who is well known as Victoria's Secret's angel. I spent approximately 10 hours on the roses. It took time to draw it, and every tiny detail of each, roses, each rose was deemed very important. Then I spent another five hours for drawing her hair. For this art, I spent more time than for any arts of my collection. It was not in 21 consecutive hours. I always tried to spend few minutes, few hours to draw it, tweaking it. And after a few months, an angel with two roses was born on a blank white paper. Today I am proud to present my sketch on the, on the cover page of the magazine and would like to express, express a special thanks to Ethan who made executive decision of putting this piece on the cover of this magazine. I would, like, I would also like to thank Hope Sebastian for allowing me once again to be a part of this magazine. I also want to thank, thank my friends and my family for the, their support. All of you has given me the strength and the power to be better and the result can be seen on the front page, on the cover page. Vincent van Gogh said, great things are done by a series of small things brought together. With, with this quotation in relation to the cover page, I would like to finish my uh, speech. Thanks again for your support and enjoy reading the magazine. Thanks. Well, thank you very much, Ethan and Hope, for uh, inviting me to the magazine launch. I'm very proud to put my pictures into the magazine. So uh, I hope people like my pictures. This is my tool I use to take pictures. It's also it captures moments. So that moment will never come back again. So that's a single moment and it will never be the same again. So for me this is a kind of art. Yeah, and I'm very proud to be here to have my art in, in the magazine. And I want to thank you, Ethan, for putting them in. Thank you very much. Okay. Right. I wanted to start off by saying thank you to my parents for letting me come in the magazine and to be worthy of, um, in the child section. Without my dad working hard every day for the past week, having problems and sorting them out, this would never have happened. I thank you for mom for giving me tips on being better and making me into a better artist than before and hopefully one day to her status.